here we are. <laughs> My name is Connor. Oh, that's <laughs> Your so name nice is Erica. You. Nice to meet you in person, right? Hi. Um, so why? How did you? Why? How did you end up here? Why did? Why did you decide that this was the right move, September? <laughs> <laughs> wow, you just. I'm so this uh, is it. Firing off here. Okay, yeah. so I was listening to uh, 99.5 in the morning. Great radio station. One yeah. of the best. Great radio station. I recommend everyone listen to it. <laughs> and I heard you speaking. Okay. And I thought it was, this is honest, I thought it was really nice that when they said you were 5'10", you corrected and said five. <laughs> you were 5'9 and 3 I mean, fourths. I don't want to, yeah. I, I just thought wanna. that's really genuine. Most guys boast about themselves. No, I will only degrade and myself. Don't worry. <laughs> so I said, you know what? This would be fun, and I might as well give it a shot. So why did you decide Sweet. to do September when they asked? I don't know. <laughs> um, you have a busy life, so. Yeah, and, and when they said it was September, uh, I was like, I am gone almost that whole month. So luckily we worked it out, though. I mean, it actually worked out pretty well. Uh it wasn't too bad. And I mean, it's been, it's been fun. It's been cool. I mean, I, yeah, why not? Might as well give it a shot, right? Yes. Hey. hey. <laughs> this is not So do real. you, I, I don't know if this is on camera. Do you know Kevin Kamek? I do know Kevin okay, Kamek. Yeah. So he went to DePauw and okay. I uh, worked in diabetes for about six months. Okay, right on. Um, and so I met him through that. And Chase Wilson. Chase Wilson. You have a, he showed me a photo of you yes. on Facebook with him. Probably, yeah. I'm horrible with names, honestly. It's okay. Like, it's terrible. Honestly. But yes, I'm sure they were all there for the I've whole month of May. This, you know lots of people that I know that yeah. I didn't know knew you. <laughs> yeah. It's a small world, Indianapolis. Yeah, Indianapolis is. is a very small world. So. Um, yeah, Kevin is really, Kevin's a good guy. He was, like, I know, huge. I got forwarded an email that said, what do you want me to respond? Yeah, yeah, he. And I wrote uh, back. I don't want to toot my own horn. You may respond whatever you want. <laughs> yeah, I th- yeah. He emailed me, I think, or he or he sent me a text or something. He's like, "Hey, I think I know one of the one of the girls in this <laughs> September thing," and I was like, "Oh wow, I think I know which one it is. Probably the one that works at Eli Lilly." The only one who works. There. That's so funny. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It you know, he's blown I, up at Lilly. Yeah, so, has it? A lot of co- colleagues know. Oh, they all great. gave me advice on what to ask you. Great, uh, awesome. <laughs> So I think we'll, we'll still sponsor you again. So oh, I, well, see that I, I was literally talking about it over the weekend last in, in Sonoma because we were I was like, we got to get him involved again next year. So they, fingers and they toes crossed. Very highly of oh, you, my so gosh. They're clearly, Kevin wrong, had clearly misled. To say. I, I doubt that. I so doubt so that. then you have things to ask me then. Oh, yeah. OK. OK. So bring it, bring it on. did you write me a poem? <laughs> No, I I can't say I've ever written Someone a poem. So I will ever. admit that my nana helps me write my poem. That was good, honestly. <laughs> All of the poems, literally. I can't even. It's fascinating. Like I've never written a poem except in, when I was in high school. Yeah, so, I was not an English major. I was an econ major. Really so impressive. Numbers. Yeah. No, She's very all good of them. At it, and then I just edited it. So yeah. To tweak it, to tweak it right a little words. bit, but no, she was. She's super helpful. That's awesome. Um, so I had to tell you three th- interesting things about myself. Okay. Uh, so what are three interesting things outside of racing, though? Uh, oh, gosh. Yourself, like, I have diabetes. <laughs> I already knew <laughs> no, that. No, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> um, like, what do you like to do outside? Maybe, I don't know. I snowboard. Three. I like to snowboard. Oh, I've I always wanted to be an X Games I medalist. Like Okay, okay, that's all right. I, I tried to ski when I was a young child, and my knees ended up like, and my legs were like twisted up like a pretzel. So I decided that wasn't a good thing, and I was going to try snowboarding. Okay. Um, so I like snowboarding. Uh, I always thought I could be a skateboarder. I always thought I could be an X Games medalist, as I said. Okay. It hasn't worked out yet. Do you do that in your free time? No, not, no, not really, because I'll time. risk injury, and I'll probably oh. break my legs and stuff like that. I've never broken a bone ever in my really? life, so knock on wood, never. That's interesting for the industry yeah. that you're in. Well, exa- exactly. I mean, I've been like, I've I've been hurting, but I've never physically like broken anything. <laughs> I broke my arm on a razor scooter. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> it's just you know, razor trying scooters to do some were tricks in. on that. Hey, razor scooters were in. They were in. I <laughs> still probably have mine. <laughs> all right. So you've that's and that has, is that like is that it? It's all you've broken. That's all just I've broken. Arm? Okay, yeah, yeah, just my left so, arm. Yeah, I've never broken anything. Um, what else is interesting? 
I I really want to be like I want to be an actor someday. Really. That's like a really random thing that I like. Hollywood fascinates me. So like the whole film production world, everything like that. So you want to like, be an actor, not like an editor, producer. No, just or... like I want to be in it, and I want to like be participating. Yeah, it's really, really random. You, I know. Do you think you're a good actor? No, I think I'm horrible. Yeah. <laughs> so you need lessons. But like, I like to like see it. Like I've okay. I got to, I've got to see things like What's made your and like. Movie? Well, that's the or thing. Actor, it's like, or do you like? <laughs> how do you judge? Don't really have it. <laughs> I am not a good judge because all my favorite movies are like the Fast and the Furious movies. Right, so okay. clearly, nice. I'm a horrible cinematic judge. Um, <laughs> But I can appreciate a good a good, a good film, right? Okay. I don't know. It's just a really random goal of mine to like sort of get somehow like be involved and in, I like I like talking about that with people who are like involved. I like right. learning about new industries that cool. I'm not involved in. Yeah, that's why I per think, se. Uh, I don't know much about race car. I've never been to the Indy 500. Oh, that's sad. I'm not from Indiana. No, it's okay. I'm from okay. Ohio, so I used I always do always watch on the TV. Yeah. But we always go to my grandparents' lake house and help them. Of like, course, clean it's the a big yeah. And power wash and that's open okay. it for the. But that's maybe fine. I'll have to go one time. Someday. Someday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But I mean, honestly, like most people I meet and like most people in this country yeah. have never been to a race or have never watched a race, right. so. I'm I very have watched used to that. it on the TV. My grandpa loves it. That's a good start. Yeah, it's so, a good start. And but it's like generally, outside of yeah. Indy, so we're always in Ohio. So exactly. It works out perfectly. But like, it's 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 not uncommon for me to like come across people. Oh, you have never seen a race? What a surprise! Like, no. it's it's normal. I try not to share that previously. It's okay. <laughs> it's totally cool. Or it's honestly interesting that September no has, is like my I'm gone three weeks. So yeah. This is my only week in Indy, so I was really good. I was in Boston and Tampa last week, oh, and wow. then on Sunday I'm going to New York, and then Denver, and then Dallas, and so I get back in the middle of October. Yeah, well, I'm. I, Maybe I shouldn't have said that. No, that's okay. <laughs> this uh, I Friday night I go to Kansas City, Sunday um, I go to Memphis and Nashville, and then we get very opposite all of my yeah, locations. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, and then LA like the seventh and eighth, and yeah. So yeah. still, even though our season's over, they like. IndyCar tries to keep us relevant, so. Right, right. So you're not doing races, but doing nope. like talk just shows anything. or Just like really random or... anything. Like, well, the, the thing in Kansas City Saturday is for the JDRF. Oh, Because okay. I'm an ambassador for the right. JDRF now, so. Makes sense. Go do like a walk for them or whatever it is. Um, oh, and then I have to do like a trade show with one of my sponsors next week. Uh, don't roll your eyes. Super, ex- super that. exciting, <laughs> super exciting things. Super I, uh, exciting things. I love traveling. But yeah, it, can, it can be, like, tiring. Disastrous. I definitely get home. Yeah. Well, flights can be boring, but I definitely yeah. get home, and I'm excited to, like, regroup this week before I head back out Yeah. on the road for a little bit of time. Not, yeah. as, not as intense as your schedule, I'm sure. Ah, uh, yeah, but, I mean, everyone has intense times, right? Like, yeah. everyone. Well, everyone's, like, yours sounds, yours is, like, way more important to the world, too. Like, your business. Alzheimer's. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. I don't know about that. Well, it, but, but like racing is just like a sport and it's like fun, but like you're yeah. like actually doing thing, good things for the world, you know? So that's <laughs> yes, important. I, I do love my job <laughs> and working for Alzheimer's. Well, there you go. It is very rewarding. And exactly. Fulfilling, so. We actually do like a, there's a karting event because I don't know if you have, have you ever heard of Dan Weldon, the driver? Mm-hmm. Okay. So his mother had Alzheimer's. So like we, we do like a big charity race a oh, lot neat. of the times for an Alzheimer's charity. Or like oh. a big charity that a goes year? towards yeah, it's like it's probably the Alzheimer's Association unless they have yes, their own charity. That it is that association. Yes, is your most yeah, that one. And it's like uh, I don't know. Just the All I know is that we were raising and, money for that. Oh. So yeah, that's very good. See, you're uh, you're already contributing to a cause <laughs> yeah, that's meaningful for me. Trying. <laughs> I we're spent doing our best. Uh, six months when I was working on a diabetes device for half dosing. For type yeah. one diabetes, disposable. Yes. <laughs> That's me. I have that. I'm trying to not have it. <laughs> I don't think you can. I know. It, I know. Unfortunately. Hey, you never but know. Let's Lily find a cure. Come up with a cure. But I'm sure that is a goal of theirs, our preventative. Right? Something like that. Know. That's all. I don't know. We sure. hope so. Yeah, definitely. Well, that's right. interesting. So, tell me about your shirt. Um, Do you like dogs? Well, who doesn't like puppies i feel like they make everyone happy right do you do yoga no i don't 
<laughs> oh no! <laughs> what were you guys talking about? His Life. Shirt. Oh Life. no! That was fun. Yeah. Travel Thank mercy. You guys. I'm Okay. You had to get your close up. People do it on reality TV. I mean, Just <laughs> like that, Probably. from what I've heard. I know the camera's on the like internet. Right here in your face. Oh my gosh, it's terrible. I say, gotta get our close up. I guess. Exactly. So, how far of a journey was this for you? Is it is it far? How far do you live from here? Um. Well, I live about 55 minutes from here, but oh, I actually geez. came from work. Okay. I got up at around three this morning. Oh gosh. I know it's been a long day, but it's been a good day. So do you live so, down like on the south side no, or? I actually, right now I'm living in Newcastle, Indiana. Oh, really? Yeah, currently. Um, do you know there's a go-kart track like, oh, like right do. there? I do, I do. Okay, because that's where I grew up racing in Newcastle, yeah. Spice Land. I know, it's yeah. a small town. Yeah. But yeah, that's where I grew up, so that's where I'm living right now because I just came back. That is far. Yeah, so I just came back to Indiana less than a year ago. Okay. So I went to school and then I... This is really awkward. I know. It's, it's so, it's <laughs> I'm so sorry. So I'm not strange. usually this awkward. But no, okay, that's... Okay, the camera in the face completely throws me. No, I, <laughs> that is super weird, by the way. It's okay, super good. weird. We're sitting in the You're not even in shot. Hey, oh, don't worry about it. Okay. So anyway. You're so tall. That other girl is so short. <laughs> I'm only 5'6". It could be worse. It's all right. But, I'm um, only 5'9 and 3 quarters. No, quarters. you're good. See, you have, three, you have like 3 and 3 quarter inches on me. Perfect. That's there good. There we go. Silver heels. Oh yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> no, um, I moved to Texas for eleven months. Okay. Um, out in like West Texas, in the middle West of nowhere. West Texas, right so on. I lived by myself there. Texas and then, is cool. I like Texas. Yeah, it's a yeah, little I warm. Yeah, I made it out to. Yeah, it was really hot because I was like I said, in the desert, like seven and a half hours west of Dallas. Okay. So I was there for eleven months working, and then I was like, eh, not really a desert girl. So yeah, yeah. I moved to South Carolina for four and a half until something opened up in Indy. Okay. So I just kind of had to get experience. And, right on. Um, my mom was going through a lot of health problems at the time. Okay. So my main focus was just kind of, you know, like being there with my family and things. Yeah. So um, she has had another surgery like February. So she's all good now. Okay. Yeah, good. Yeah, So now awesome. it's like I kind of started looking at, okay, what are my living options? Yeah. And things like that. So that's why I was kind of put on standby. So. I'm still out in Newcastle at the moment. And yeah. I just kind of. How far looking. are you? Do you know where the track is? Like, how far are you from the little go kart track there? Uh, I've, I know that there's a track. It's so right I'm, off 70. Like, the okay. like this. I'm probably about 15, 20 minutes. Then. Okay, right on. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah, yeah. I literally, like, that was that, that drive, like, 70 to Newcastle was really? like every day of my childhood, like, from age that 12 so cool. to 16. Yeah, you were like right every in weekend. Neck of wood. Yeah, yeah, yep. exactly. Yep. That's so right funny. It's a small world. We, it really gosh. is. It is. I like it out there. I do too. I mean, like, there's nothing there, right. but the so track is really kinda cool. Nice, yeah, yeah. You know, because um, like I didn't grow up on a farm or anything. Okay. But I didn't grow up in town. I grew up yeah. more like out in the country. So I mean, there's like cornfields and woods everywhere. <laughs> but I Same. mean, yeah, yeah, exactly. So I mean, I think it's kind of a, you know, different way to grow up. It kind yeah. of, you know, you can go out in the city and have fun. Yeah. But yet, you know how to just kind of like stay in and chill. And yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah that's all right. It's important. Do you like? And so do you you do enjoy it out there like you don't mind it out there no i i love it like okay. i said um i've had the opportunity when i was gone to kind of like yeah. live in the cities because i lived in the cities um both well a little bit of what you call the city of yeah. Midland, and then um same thing in south carolina um so it was kind of nice to have both yeah. of those aspects for sure um so i That's can cool. i know i can go either way yeah. but i definitely kind of like the the laid back yeah, yeah, yeah atmosphere and then you can pick and choose when you go and i go to the hustle bustle yeah i'm not yeah i don't think i'm I don't think I'm a city person. Yeah. I, like I, no. I was like I, I, the last two weeks I was in San Francisco and LA and yeah, it's a like San much. Francisco, uh, it's just too much. Like I yeah. like, I just like freedom to like roam exactly. around and like I obviously like cars, so right. I'd like to drive somewhere. It's kind of uh, hard, but like so I would congested. never want to drive in San Francisco right. or or LA. Well, LA. See, I've I only drive been to LA. Time. I've never been to San Francisco. I went to yeah. LA last summer, and I was like, okay, this is okay to visit, but. I was like, yeah. I do not want to live here. It's just, it's yeah. too much. It's like I, I said, I like I, I love Southern California. Like, I love uh-huh. it. Uh-huh. I've never been there. I would, I would like to, and this is very hard to do, but, I, like, I would like to have, like, a, a winter place. Like, right. maybe in, like, on the beach somewhere. Right. Like, I wouldn't be fully committed to living there because exactly. I couldn't deal. No. I, I, I think I couldn't you and I are it. on the same page yeah. on this yeah. for sure. I couldn't deal with it. In San exactly. Francisco, I would never live there. I mean, it was okay, uh-uh. but I just... I Luckily, like LA I more. LA. The weather's better. I have more friends in LA and like mm-hmm. just Southern California. Right, it's a good getaway spot, yeah. but not like for your yeah. main place. But again, that takes like a vast income that will probably never come my way. But it's nice to think about. Right, nice to think about. there's options. <laughs> yeah, good to keep nice your to think about. Open. Yeah, uh-huh. so LA. So where where is like your your favorite 
like place that you've traveled to? Where's like the my favorite place I've place? traveled to? Oh, I love travel. I traveled quite a bit um, in my life. That's um, cool. Same. And yeah, I think <laughs> I really like London. Okay, I London. lived there for three summers. Did you? Yeah. I did not yeah. know that. Yeah, yeah, I really sorry. Like if you, West yeah. London. Yeah, I really liked it. That's um, cool. I went there my junior year okay. of college. Um, just for spring break. It was yeah. kind of one of the things my major you Checked had. It out. Yeah, you had to kind of either do a foreign language for three semesters or go abroad for like a week or two. I was like, that's an easy. Yeah. Option. So we went to London, Paris, and Amsterdam. Okay. So it was interesting. It was a good trip. And then yeah. um, I went to the Caymans one oh, time right when I was on. younger. And I've they did like got to go with there. the stingrays and My things. My family's it's gone so there cool. like twice. Really? And every, Why, were, or like three racing? times. Yeah. And oh. I was racing. And I was like, that's cool, guys. You guys got great yeah. pictures. We're, yeah. And it looks awesome. And yeah. I was like in some horrible <laughs> hotel, like a Motel 6 in the middle of nowhere where ra- all the racetracks are in the world. So. Right. Where's where somewhere that you want to go that you've not gotten to? Uh, any tropical island. Any tropical basically. island. Basically, like the Caymans. Um, yeah. Bahamas are nice. I've been there Bali, before. Bali, yeah. I've, I've Ooh, been to the Bali. Bahamas. Yeah. I've been to the Bahamas, yes. I, like I went them. there when I was like, I don't know, like 2005. Okay. A long I was time younger. Ago. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. I thought I was younger. But yeah, I want to go, some, I want to go like tropical. I want to go to the Maldives. I want to go to Bora Bora. I want to go to, I want to go like those crazy places. All right. Yeah. I don't know if that's going to happen, but I like know. I all my stupid friends do it all the time and I see it and it looks great, but I've never got to go. <laughs> I really want to go to Italy. Yes. That's okay. I, I live like, there okay, too. That's like my, like on the top of my list. It's so cool. I, go. I mean, it's like super old school really? and like super beautiful, obviously. And the food is incredible. So that's like cool. definitely go if you definitely get a chance. A yeah. spot. I was like more up in like the, um, where was I? Uh, Padova is the little city called. It was oh, okay. like it was near Venice, um, hmm. and Venice is obviously like right. crazy, like exactly. super, super. But it's I, I I love technology and like yeah, like just basically like the current era and like the future. Right. But like Italy is super like twenty years ago, right? right. So so you're still like <laughs> looking for Wi-Fi is like a whew, like that's it's a delicacy, right? right? So that's kind of. But it is cool. I, I totally, totally. It's a good place, it. but you only expect to sightsee. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and and eat pizza, like a lot pizza. of pizza. Can't yeah. wrong with pizza. Do you like pizza? Yes. Okay, I like good. Meat lovers pizza is my favorite. Whew. Then we're on the is same page. Yep. See, and I, I know, just bought like, like four meat games, pizzas. Meat lovers yeah. pizza and video games. That's like a great night. <sighs> That's good. That's mm-hmm. important because yes. the power has been out at my house all day today, oh. and I was planning on playing some Xbox. What game? Destiny. But that's one I've not played. Okay, that's all right. That's fine. Not many mm-hmm. people have, probably. I'm sure. But the power's been out of the house all day because uh. James didn't pay the bill. So <laughs> good job, James. Um, he's too busy shaking his He's hip. too busy <laughs> dancing. He's forgotten to pay the power bill. <laughs> and so, so hopefully it's on by the time I get home. Oh but I gosh. don't know if it will be. <laughs> so that's an interest. I hope James hears this at some point. Hopefully, um, I shouldn't tune complain in. to him for tune anything. Seven thirty. <laughs> but James, you. <laughs> You didn't pay the power bill. <laughs> I hope that's on camera. Oh <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, this is completely off topic, but I know, yeah. like you mentioned about like your family going on vacation mm-hmm. and things, and something that I was asked earlier was like the dating scenario. They yeah. were asking about like my family, like and about like Thanksgiving and things like that. Yeah. And it just kind of made me curious. Like, what is like what kind of holidays are important to your family, or like what kind of traditions do you have? Christmas. Like that? Me too. Huge. I love Christmas. I'm like huge Christmas fanatic. Yes. yes. No. And, and, and so is special. Well, like so. So my parents are divorced. So like my right. my mom is the big Christmas. Okay. The big Christmas woman, right? Um, and I I love Christmas. Like, oh my goodness, me too. But, I but like it, start decorating. Oh yeah. Like, yeah. like yeah. the last. I week think we October, have Christmas decorations November. up right now. Oh yeah. <laughs> I, I, well, actually, no, we don't. But yeah. We started the end of October, early November. We get. Oh yeah. My family always gets. All it's this. big. Yes. Yeah, All but out. we we like, change we, everything. Soap dispenser styles, whole oh, yeah. nine yards. Yeah, but we, um, yeah. So like, there used to be a go kart race uh-huh. in in Daytona, Florida, that we'd have to leave for like on Christmas Day, and I hated this because like my dad was like, "Oh, you don't want to do this? Like, you don't want to leave on Christmas? Like, you're not you're not dedicated to racing?" And I was like. <laughs> I am, but, like, it's Christmas. Right. So, I, like, it was a real, like, crossroads in my racing career because my dad thought I didn't want to be a racing driver because I didn't want to leave on Christmas. Christmas. But it was the worst-timed race in the history of go-kart racing. But we got through it. 
We got through it. Oh my gosh. Did that scare you guys? Yes. Dave Smiley is super creepy. <laughs> okay. All right. Coming up. Now. How did that go? Is it okay? Yeah, it was great. Okay, except okay. for. 99.5 ZPL. Here we go. Uh, this is the category athletic chicks, the ladies. Erica, 25 years old, and uh, from Il- Eli Lilly. She's got the dog, right? <laughs> the dog, the puppy Eli. Yeah, yeah. Nikki's 25. The She's the shirt. airport girl. And uh, here, here we are. How did the dates go, by the way? Awesome. Uh, yeah? Terrific. Now, yeah. I know she put shades on. What are those? I'm are, nervous. Are those your protective shades? You make you think that no one can see you? I'm nervous, Will. <laughs> yeah, you should be. Don't be. It's a uh, let's game, see. But it's let's a great see. game. Uh, let's see. Erica, how do you think uh, your date went? I think it went wonderful for only being 10 minutes long. <laughs> yeah, it's Swimmingly. a speed date. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, and how about you, uh, Nikki? I, I kind of agree with Erica. You can only do so much in 10 minutes, but I felt like the 10 minutes went well. Anything uh, new you learned, uh, Erica, fr- about uh, Connor Daly during that last 10 minutes? <laughs> He wants to be an actor. <laughs> really? Yeah. Wow. I see. I missed some of that. I was over yeah, drinking no, a beer. I heard that too. It's bizarre to me, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> you could start in adult erotica and work your way. Well, What's I don't that? think you have much of it. a future. <laughs> porn. It's porn, buddy. That's a terrible thing. Yeah. Well, I'm a wholesome human. You look good. You're though. not. You have a lot more practice than I do. <laughs> okay. That's weird. Uh, how about Nikki? What did you learn anything new? Yeah. I mean, like when we were talking, we kind of found some more common interests in that we both are kind of like consider ourselves more small town people but yeah like we like to go out to the city and just kind of our lifestyles yeah tony now what you were listening in on the conversations there last break here so um i feel like uh connor did a lot of the talking with nikki um and erica did more talking but i wasn't sure if he was just trying to solidify a sponsorship deal with <laughs> Eli Lilly. Oh, oh. <laughs> Working deal. Yeah, it is kind or of true. Not. And also, like, diabetes, diabetes curable <laughs> devices. Oh my God. I'm she trying is. to cure myself, okay? Yeah. Can I add in my... So and I, you are that personally with them. So I basically what I'm doing is I'm sitting at a table with all these girls, prepping them before so they weird. go in okay. and getting a chance to get to know them on a different level. And when we were at the table, I feel like Nikki did a lot more talking. Interesting. So it's interesting to hear how the dates change when they're with the Connor. Tony's drunk. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, Wingman Will, any thoughts on this? Oh, man, I thought uh, it was both pretty interesting. Yeah, I felt like uh, <laughs> Connor and Erica <laughs> talked a lot about uh, curing his diseases. <laughs> <laughs> And it's true. It's just. <laughs> and, uh, I noticed a theme in, in the conversation with Nikki. Connor kept like it wasn't so much about Nikki as much as he was thrilled that she lived near the go kart track. <laughs> <laughs> what? I like that. He was like, "Oh, really? How far from the go kart track?" <laughs> Let's go there. <laughs> oh, the go kart track. Okay. Well, dim the lights. Where they want to travel, but it's up to you. Man. Yeah, we do have know. to dim they're the lights. This is here. They both seem great. They're right, right here in front of you. They're staring at you. you this want, is, <laughs> how bad do you want your diabetes cured? That's <laughs> Hey, that's true. Okay, that's true. so hey, did, was it, was this the same for for Nikki? Over oh here? yeah, oh, yeah. No, it, it was wasn't. actually. I didn't have to do it in person. I feel so bad for you right now. Well, your schedule's so tight, man. Yeah. We had to do it like. Yeah, this. I got to see fault. my my buddy's EDM DJ downtown. I got to I got to see my buddy mixing live. This like, is your problem. That's true. Listen, <laughs> that's a this true is statement. a big deal. Indiana will be I have plans. If you <laughs> sorry, you, you have EDM buddy is more important than no, what, every not. Hoosier. Is curious about who you're gonna date for the next rest of your life. I Marriage. Am, this is, and and this is the last time I've ever been on the 99.5 WD Pro <laughs> show. Right here. You're gonna disappoint all those other girls. This is it. Okay. So here's Erica. Right. Here's okay. There's, the there they are. Yeah. There. there they are. Um. So so now I have to make the decision. You have to make like a decision. Right you know. And these guys have both been prepped. They they're having fun with this. So. Okay. Um, Look at them, not at me. <laughs> But but I love you, Will. No, just, wait, did you see that, that people think that we hate each other on yeah, the internet? Did, That's really funny. Awesome. <laughs> people think that we hate each other on the internet. It's really funny. Um, okay, so the time has come. The time has come. I do want to cure diabetes. Let me tell you what. <laughs> but I do like go-kart racing. Um, I am going to go with... What are your names again? No, it's... <laughs> Erica. I'm going with Erica. And Nikki. I'm, going to, I'm going with Erica. Erica! Oh my gosh! Ah! Wow. Let's cure diabetes. Woo! Uh, yeah. That's it. Wow. It's sold it. Why did you go with uh, Erica? Oh, they're kissing. They're hugging. They're hugging. Um, um, 
Because I like the business of Eli Lilly oh, and yeah, this is no, really cool. no, no, no. You're being you. All right, so you just no, 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 no. no. I, 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 you got a good conversation. I have no reasons in my, that I write in my head. Yeah, That's right on. It's terrible. Right. Well, now I got to plan an hour date. So I know. So now then you'll go to the final four, and then, so you got to come up with a fun, fun date. You have any Whoa. ideas right now? Wait, they have to pick it. So they have to come up with a date. We thought it'd be fun for the ladies. Oh. To wow. decide. I have some ideas, but I'm not going to share them. Okay. All right. Maybe Nikki can show you where that go-kart Because then someone might steal my is. idea. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There you go. Uh, on to the final four. It's Erica. She works at Eli Lilly. She's got a dog. <laughs> and she walked the Great Wall of China once. We'll be back with more September in a second. Hold on, everybody.